Hi guys, Matt here from Matt Design, and in this video I want to show you how to set up a web form um, in the new Active Campaign form builder. So it's pretty cool. So the first thing um, I'll show you, I've got the lists I want to connect a form to for the website, and then um, I've got the forms tabs. So I've done one, so I'm going to set up a new one. So let's do uh, the web callback. So if we add a new form, so we'll call this website callback. It's pretty generic. And then we're going to choose inline form. Uh, subscribe to the list so you can add the tag if you wanted to. I'm not going to. I'm going to subscribe to the list. So uh, web callback. There we go. And I'm going to press create. And then inside here we want to add some fields. So kind of gives you a few, a few defaults. So phone, I'm going to drag that on. And so we've got full name, email, phone. So let's have a look at what the client wants. So you can't see me, I'm messing around on another screen. So they just want first name, last name. Okay, so last name, first name. Cool. So that's that. Um, those are the fields all I, all I want. So just need to change a few settings. So if we come to the bottom, we've got options. So subscribe to list, show thank you. We're going to open a URL. So that's where we want to send people. So in my site, I'm just going to get um, the location of the thank you page. Bear with me. I've got two screens, so that's if you're thinking, what's he doing? I've got another screen. I don't really need you to see it. So this is where the URL for the other site goes. Okay. Um, and then we're going to click on options. For so this is the opt-in options. So this used to be a ball eight before in Active. You had to click on loads of different links, but they've really kind of cleaned it up nicely. So here, um, opt-in confirmation. I'm going to untick that and press save. Okay. And then, <clears throat> depending on how you're going to integrate it with your website, just click on the word integrate. Um, I, I'm. Uh, you can do a simple embed. Grab the code, and just whack it in. Um, I am a coder, so I generally just grab the code and kind of link it in myself. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to copy that, and then I'm going to go into Dreamweaver, strip it out a bit, and then put it into the website. But I just thought I'd show you how the new form builder works and how to build forms in an active campaign. Thanks for watching. Bye.